Local Storm Team Meteorologist Chelsea Chandler with the Mid-South's most accurate forecast. This is Good Day Memphis on CW30. All right, 743, so glad you're with us here on Good Day Memphis. Thanks for waking up with us this morning. Chelsea's got her eyes on the day ahead here. Dry to start, no worry about rain. Yeah, you don't need the umbrella today. It's not going to be a rainy one. In fact, it's a very clear start to the day, and that will continue. We did have a dense fog advisory early this morning that was allowed to expire early. So now we're just really looking at cooler temperatures. We are in the 30s, feeling even a little cooler. 39 here in Memphis feels more like 36. But as you can see, our temperatures, well, they range anywhere from 31 up to 39. So no matter where you live, it is going to be a chilly start for us. But the great news is that's not going to be the case all day long. In fact, we're going to keep this sunshine going throughout the day and it'll allow our temperatures to climb pretty quickly. But this morning around 9 o'clock, it's still on the chillier side, 43 degrees. But as we get to the lunch hour, we're already up about 11 degrees to 54. And this afternoon, it's going to be almost a repeat of yesterday as we see those temperatures in the upper 50s, near 60 degrees. So a nice and comfortable day to get out in whether you need to uh, get some things off your honey-do list. Maybe you have to put some last-minute Christmas decorations up. Whatever it is today will be a really good day to get that taken care of. As we get to tomorrow, things begin to change. We have this area of low pressure. It's a pretty strong one that's going to build into the area and it does bring the threat for rain and possibly severe weather. Now the good news is it doesn't bring that threat necessarily for us. It's mostly out of our area, but for us we do see the chance for rain and even a few rumbles of thunder, especially as we head into Thursday. The same area of low pressure though will continue its track through the week towards the northeast and as it does it could even bring a lot of snow. So if you're planning on flying to the northeast either Friday or Saturday, it'll be a good idea to continue to monitor those flights as they could be impacted. But as we take a look at the hour by hour for us Starting tomorrow, it's going to be clear to start, but we start to see the clouds building in. And as we do late in the evening, we start to see some rain to the south. Overnight, though, that becomes very widespread, uh, just in time for us to have a nice and soggy commute on Thursday morning. So that's certainly going to slow us down. The heavier rain, though, makes its way in later in the day on Thursday, completely getting out of here overnight into early Friday morning hours, which we will start off at least dry and clear. So as we get through the rest of your seven day, today looks good, sunny and 58. Tomorrow, 60. Again, most of the problems start to come in late in the evening, so we should be fine aside from um, some clouds. But Thursday looking like a washout, unfortunately, 80% chance of rain, cool in the low 50s, even cooler on Friday, even with the sunshine will be in the 40s. Saturday and Sunday look good for your last minute shopping in the low 50s and sunny and even Christmas Eve on Monday looks nice again around 52 degrees. So not too bad of a forecast, just a couple showers you got to get through, but we'll continue to track it all and keep you up to date with the very latest on your forecast on Twitter as long as you're following us at Local Memphis.